My name is Rob Hoppe, Greenlee Territory Manager. This video is designed to familiarize you with the family of Greenlee non-contact voltage detection testers. This is the GT11. The GT11 is a Category 4 1000 volt rated non-contact voltage detection tester. This tool operates as low as 50 volts and signals the user of AC voltage with intermittent lights and a GT11 operation. Turn the unit on by rotating the cap to the on position. It's best to test on a known live circuit to verify that the unit is working properly and that the batteries are fully charged. Place the tip of the unit into a receptacle or mirror wire. The intermittent beeping and LED lights indicate the presence of AC voltage. The GT11 cannot detect AC voltage in cable through a metallic shield such as armored cable or metallic conduit. Like any non-contact voltage tester, the GT11 can be sensitive to static electricity. A handy way to check the batteries of a unit is rub it against your shoulder, see that you get the LED lights and the beeping. This, however, is not a substitute for testing on a known light. The batteries in the GT11 simply turn the cap in the opposite direction you would to turn it on, about an eighth of a turn. The cap will come off, remove the batteries, replace with new AA alkalines. There is a battery diagram on the side of the tool to ensure that you line up the polarity of the batteries properly. Reinstall the batteries, pop the top back on, turn the unit on, and test on a known live circuit. Now you're ready to go. The GT15 low voltage detector is intended to check for the presence of AC voltage down to 12 volts, signaling the user with an intermittent beeping tone and flashing LED. The GT15 is different from the GT11 in that it has a rounded bull nose and a yellow cap. This is a Category 3, 300 volt rated tester. The GT15 is useful for detecting the presence of AC voltage in low voltage applications such as HVAC thermostats, industrial control wiring, doorbells, and low voltage lighting. The operation of the GT15 and the changing batteries are basically the same as the GT11. Test on a known live circuit before use, and simply remove the cap to change the batteries. The GT16 is a Category 4 1000 volt rated tester with adjustable sensitivity. Its range is from 5 volts all the way up to 1000 volts. It signals the user of the presence of AC voltage through intermittent beeps and flashing LEDs. Turn on the GT16. Rotate the thumb wheel toward the tip. Verify the LED is blinking about every two seconds or so. This is a self battery check feature. The GT16 combines the capabilities of the GT11 and the GT15 with an adjustable sensitivity dial. By rotating the adjustable sensitivity wheel towards the tip, we decrease the sensitivity. By rotating it back towards the cap, we increase the sensitivity. To remove the batteries on the GT16, rotate the pocket clip. There's a secondary battery cap. Rotate that 90 degrees to expose the battery. The GT16 uses only one AAA battery. Install a new battery, reinstall the battery cap with a 90 degree twist, reinstall the pocket clip. Turn the unit on, be sure to test it on a known live circuit.
The GT12 is a Category 4 1000 volt rated non-contact voltage detection tester. It is intended to check for the presence of AC voltage, signaling the user with an intermittent tone and flashing LED. The tone can be disabled using the smart on-off button. The GT12 has a self-test feature that continuously tests the integrity of the entire unit, including the antenna. The GT12 also features low battery indication and an auto power off feature. To turn on the GT12 with both audible and visual indication of the presence of AC voltage, simply press and release the green cap at the end of the unit. To turn on the GT12, with a visual only indication of the presence of AC voltage, simply press and hold the green button for two blinks of the LED, about three seconds. Once the GT12 is on, a blinking LED verifies the self-test feature of this tester is enabled. Before testing on an unknown circuit, test on a known live circuit. Place the probe tip near the circuit to be tested. A blinking LED and a tone indicates the presence of AC voltage. The GT12 automatically turns off after about five minutes of not being used. To remove the batteries of the GT12, slide back the retaining clip, remove the battery cover, and replace with two new AAA batteries. Replace the battery cover, Turn the unit on, and a blinking LED about every four seconds indicates that the self-test feature of the unit is enabled. Hopefully this video answers any questions you would have on Greenlee's family of non-contact voltage detection testers, but if you need additional assistance, please contact product management or technical services. Thanks.